I'm going to just look at the market watch here and uh, here I know there are other stocks also that we can look at but as of now that's not my focus uh, I'm focusing on Google because we want to make sure that we can uh, you know salvage this trade so here we are we have a positive Delta here 58 positive Delta let's see 570 and this is 1107.5 okay all right so we got it at 590 we are still down about 550 on this trade okay we are still down about 550 on this trade i think we got the debit spread in at the right time because we got 5.9 uh, you know it was going for like 7.5 and uh, 8 so as as google went down we got into the debit spread which is good that bar was good on google not so good on the s p that was a decent bar on google as well as the s p but there was some selling coming in at the end over there on the s p so so this bar is going to end it's looking promising on the s p now granted there's going to be a battle over there and so you know there's a battle between the bulls and the bears going on both google and boeing are uh, pretty well correlated right now so it looks like some selling on this bar definitely because higher volume and it got pushed down to close to the bottom so definitely some selling there boeing is still looking strong okay boeing is still looking strong yes definitely es uh, turning around over the last if you look at the last three or four bars uh, definitely turning around this was the only weak bar i think there was definitely some selling there but uh, it's looking better it's it's looking better and better but the goal is to have the PL for the day come to 750 if the PL for the day comes to 750 then we've broken uh, even on the trade now it doesn't mean that i, I i'm going to wait till uh, I, it gets to 750 if it gets to 400 or 500 uh, you know i i have no problem taking a losing uh, losing trade because that's that's what the game is you know we've had 10 uh, 10 winners in a row and so uh, it's uh, you know a losing trade is bound to come our way and the, the key is you just don't lose too much on the losing trade that's all if anybody was in the Boeing trade that would have been a good exit it, it uh, do it did do a high over there okay 21% all right one awesome awesome okay closed out yeah okay all right excellent excellent yeah I was just gonna say because Boeing made a nice move there okay so this one is up 688 okay this one is up 688 i'll tell you what i'll take a profit on half of it so i'm going to buy back two of those and book about 300 dollars profit okay the calculations we can do uh, you know even later because uh, we can run a report on that so i'm not particularly concerned about that but i think we booked perhaps uh, 623 313 exactly half of this yeah so 300 bucks we booked a profit on that and because the markets uh, look like they want to move up so uh, let's try to let's try to make the best out of it so we have plus five minus two okay nice move up there let's see where we are all right we are up 266 for the day that was a good move uh, on all the stocks as well as the SP Google's uh, moved into very bullish of course right now it's in a transition state so it can move from very bullish back to neutral or something like that uh, because it, it, it just moved into very bullish so we have to see it might go go back into neutral but regardless at least some of the internals are telling us that okay things are looking okay for Google alphabet is now 1107 sorry I did the, that thing again let's go back to monitor we are up 432 for the day uh, now we are 470 450 so I would say totally about 700 we are required 570 plus 200 7, 770 okay guys this is good all right so I'm gonna first close this short off we got a profit there still so I'm gonna buy it buy two at four let's do it all right yeah should get a better price 370 now it's gone up to 1108 so where do we stand 797 so this brings us to break even on the trade for 829 we are actually up a little bit so uh, sell 5 930 960 uh, 960 uh, Google's moving up nicely let's see the monitor again 1058 now we are clearly in the profit here clearly in the profit okay I'm going to close it because we've been fighting with this trade from yesterday and uh, I want to get 950 in which case it will be about a 900 plus 200 1100 ultimately we will be plus on this trade if we can get this uh, order filled here at 950 
so turning okay 950 exactly so we made 900 today and yesterday we made 200 so that's 1150 and um, you know we were down 950 at the end so uh, the way to look at it is yesterday's video if you catch the end of that video when we uh, converted this into a minus four and plus five you know the, the the loss at that point was about 950 or 960 or something like that so to uh, and then it ended uh, or rather this morning it started out where uh, you know we had already recovered 200 from yesterday's action and today we did 9 990 so we can do the reports later but basically uh, i think we are slightly up of course granted there'll be some uh, pretty decent commission costs on this trade because we uh, we did go in and out uh, quite a bit so this is good guys this is the way you want to recover uh, a losing trade because if you fight for your losers uh, the winners will come the winners will come you have to fight for your losers and that's exactly what we did today and that's what i want to do uh, sort of uh, convey in this uh, in this session today so if you want a free trial of this day trading signal service you can go to this bitly link it's bitly uh, slash day hyphen signals now the day and the uh, the d and the s has to be capitals and once you go there you can get a free trial you can, you'll need to sign up there and you'll get a free trial and uh, at the end of one week if you don't want to continue you can just send us an email at info at option tiger.com and we'll give you a full refund so once again the bitly link is bitly slash day hyphen signals with the dns in caps thank you